FMG Capo, man, Capo Vision TV, man. Before I get this video started, man, y'all gonna subscribe to the channel, press that like button, and comment on what's going on. So this video right here is about why me and other people hate jobs. This is why we hate jobs. Now, mind y'all, I got a little job. It's a little half a job. I work a few days just to pay these couple of bills I got. So it's strictly for them two little bills. So I work three days a week. But one thing about the job is a job is worse than the streets, man, like for real. Like it's so messy at a job. Everybody gossiping about everybody. Uh, talking behind each other's backs, lying on people. Like, I'm talking about it's crazy. And see, like, the gig that I'm at right now is all black folks. Uh, so you know what that means. You, you know it's out of control. I'm talking about ain't nobody professional. Uh, everybody, uh, Everybody in that thing crazy. Ain't nobody professional. Everybody talking behind each other back. Everybody lying on each other. Um, it's just it's just ridiculous. And then when it comes to jobs, like they let you know the job is kind of like prison. Like you know, in prison they just let you know basically you ain't nothing but a number. You know what I'm saying? As soon as you get released, it's gonna be another one coming replacing you. And the job is the same way. That's why I can't stand people who is in love with jobs. Because they don't care nothing about you. They're going to work you 30, 40, 50 years. Then when you retire, they're going to give you 1500 a month and you still going to be struggling. You've been mediocre your whole life dealing with this job. Like, I don't see how people did it. 30, 40 years, you working here, you done retired. Man, ain't no way. I'm going to be like my daddy. My daddy hustled all the way out. Long live my daddy, bro. Like, for real, for real. Like, I don't know. It's crazy. Then you know how you got them certain people at the job. Uh, so you got one dude. Yeah, we made uh, we made $34,000 last night. No, they made $34,000 last night. You made 102 before taxes. Weird. Uh, you feel me? You get what I'm saying, though? The company, man. I can't stand the old company, man, because these folks could care. They could care less about you and what you doing in here. And as soon as you slip, they're going to find somebody to, to replace you. My job, they stay. I'm talking about the managers gossiping behind each other back. Come on, bro. Like, how, like, bro. I'm talking about when I tell y'all I'm sick of them. I'm finna do YouTube full time though, cause I'm sick of them folks. Like, no cap, bro. These folks is just really out of control in the um. Then I got one dude. Now, mind you, he a good dude. He like he's a good dude, but uh, they offer them position, and he gonna say, "Yeah, I've been dreaming about this all my life." What? What? You been dreaming about this all your life. So you telling me that your dream was to work for somebody else? Man, come on now. Come on now. Your dream was to work for somebody else. Man, come on, bro. All right, I'm telling you, people need to get it together, man. Real talk. These jobs can care less about you. That's why I love the fact that um, <clears throat> one thing that COVID did do, COVID showed everybody that they could do it on their own. That's why it's hard to keep people at jobs nowadays because they looking at it like they got options. They like, sure, we thugged it out through COVID. Sure, we going to, you feel me, we can make it through anything. People was getting laid off at COVID. People weren't going to work at COVID. People made a way. People started cooking plates. People start selling clothes. People start selling lashes, start doing hair. I'm talking about doing all kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? 
But yeah, like this job, the job thing is crazy. I'm really over it. Um, all these old company men and messing this. You see the difference between the job and the streets. On the streets, you could <laughs> smack somebody. The job you go to work and smack somebody, you going to jail. You going to jail, and people be so fake at work. Come straight up to yeah, yeah. Man, Rod, man, Rod, he, he don't be doing his job. He don't be doing this and this and that. He'll be like, yeah, 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 I feel you, though. And go right back behind your back. Hey, man, Capo said, man, Capo said, man, you ain't been doing your job, bro. You such and such. Man, come on. It's a one girl been working. And a one girl at work been lying on me for so long. She lucky. But really, I had my gal go up there and smack her. You feel me? I just be leaving it alone because I know these folks is just, you know, they're going to be what they is. But anybody, if your dream is to go work at work for somebody else for the rest of your life, you need to reevaluate your life. I don't know, man. Y'all tell me what y'all think in the comments. But the job thing, is, I'm telling you, is really just not for me, man. How y'all feel about these gigs? Let me know in the comments, man. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. FMG.